Choice to Mayo was a concept that our president came up with, Frank Reardon. Instead of Cinco de Mayo, he, we, he wanted to have a party during the week for our customers and our vendors and employees. And he came up with Trace de Mayo. And as a theme, instead of you know the Mexican and margaritas and all that, his theme was everything should be in threes. What I liked about Trace de Mayo was the chance to basically meet a lot of DMC's customers that I don't work with every day. We put three themed content on all the TVs. That included uh, TV shows that have three in them, such as Three's Company, Three Stooges, and clips of athletes that wore the number three. The most exciting thing we did is we put together 3D content. Uh, we found a lot of clips on YouTube. Uh, people do uh, Anoglyph 3D, which is the red, blue 3D, um, you know, the traditional glasses you think of. 3D was my favorite part of Trace Tomorrow. Uh, probably hearing my coworkers play in the band. Ashley and Eric, uh, they were really jamming. Uh, we played about six uh, New Orleans Dixieland style tunes. Just a medley of traditional New Orleans jazz and um, a couple of actually like uh, big band arrangements. Um, I have a lot of personal investment into our ping pong table and we played quite a bit of ping pong, about two hours and most of the time with our clients. So it was a great time to kind of share a little bit of competitive spirit. Be up on the roof with with vendors, with clients, with coworkers, and just uh, just mingling and enjoying the the space as well as the people. Just a good time, lots of uh, food, beer. Trace, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> DMC, smart people, expert solutions.